Hello everybody, how's it going? Alexer Studios here. So it was garbage pickup day and I saw this on the side of the road and I'm like, oh hell no, we can't let this go to garbage. This is a mint condition Dell 6030i or 630i to be precise, that's, I just call it 6030. And this I believe to be in mint condition because if you look here, it has all the original plastic on it except this panel right here. But honestly, these are just smudges. I don't really know how much of this is really a scratch than just a smudge. Now, I'm no stranger to this case. These are very popular. People like to put sleeper computers in here. I have one as a server, but it's in way worse condition, not having any of the original parts. The floodlights don't even work. And honestly, it's just a server. But this was a great find because it has all of the original components and all of the original dust. But if we open up here and take a look, as you can tell, it's definitely been used. Just look at that. Chipset fan, CPU cooler, SLI, I believe it to be a GTX 460, I believe, but we're gonna check that out once we get this thing going. Of course, the hard drive is unfortunately not in here. I'm sure the owner removed it when taking this case apart. But I have two SATA cables in here and all the power I need. So we're going to have to get a spare hard drive or something out of here. Of course, we are here to do a little TLC to this thing. Ignore that sound in the background, just a hot water heater. I'm using my basement workbench because this thing is just covered in dust. And I'm not putting this shit in my room, uh-uh. So it has a really nice media bay. It has a, a DVD drive in here. So I got my little workbench over here. I got a spare monitor with VGA already hooked up. It's just a little Think Vision. I got a keyboard and mouse, power cable. Got some cleaner, I was gonna use rubbing alcohol, but now we gotta be gentle with this thing, uh-uh. And a brand new can of compressed air and I fix it kit for taking anything apart. So let's first, let's clean this up and then see if it all works. Okay, so we're gonna start with dusting since that is gonna be the messiest part here. Well, hope you guys like global warming. It's gonna be a lot of it. This thing smells bad. It smells like cats. Whew. Whoever had this had a lot of cats. Wow. This can's getting really cold. It's starting to ice up. You know, that's refrigerant for you. Okay. So if you look here, we got a lot of dust. <laughs> Holy shit. Look at that dust. Watch this. <laughs> this could be the fun part right here. Ready? Oh yeah, the power supply is probably the worst. That's basically the exhaust fan on this thing. You could put a 40 millimeter right here, but obviously they didn't. Just look at that, it's just coming out the edge. Like it's really icing up now. Look at that. It's cold. Really cold. Wow. Let's just pull this guy. I'm sure this is where the hard drive was, boys. This is where those Corona masks come in handy. No joke. Let's give this thing a little rotate. Gotta get these little inputs better on the CPU. There's little vents up here. This is a way to take this whole shroud off. I mean, I'm sure there is, but let's be honest, if I try, it's gonna break. <laughs> Knowing my luck. Ow, that's cold. Holy shit off my desk here. There's dust everywhere. Okay, 
Okay, we're gonna have to let this can sit for a bit. There's like literally ice cubes forming on this can because you know, we're just letting it loose here. Holy shit, look at that shine. That's a shine you don't see elsewhere. Okay, so now we're gonna do the front. Obviously there's still a lot of dust, so. No, the fans aren't spinning, so that's good. I mean, they, they're free, but they're fine. Look at that. We're gonna let the, we're gonna have to let this thing warm up for a while. There's no more dusting we can do. Cause it's getting weaker and it's smelling really bad. There's bitter in that shit. And, mm -mm. So basically what happened is I installed Windows 7 on here and I actually almost got the SLI to work but one little problem it appears that uh, something happened to my hard drive and I lost half the video footage from my other camera and I even lost uh, a lot of video footage for another video I was making at the same exact time and it's a huge bummer because um, this video was actually going to be a pretty good video, so unfortunately you guys only get to see one of the angles in this video. So this video is a little janky, now you know why, because I had B-roll footage and secondary angles the whole time, but they were deleted. I also lost the video when I was upgrading some UPS batteries. I was like, oh that would be a pretty good video because I got an APC and a cyber power. But no, we're just stuck. Here. Now, if this looks like Vista, that's because it is. I'm giving somebody this computer. They want to play some really old games, and unfortunately, it did not work on 7. So we're going to try a little legacy version of Windows. We are installing Windows Vista 32-bit to give this guy every fighting chance of playing his really old games. I did try XP, but unfortunately, it does not support SATA drives, and this BIOS did not have like a legacy mode built in. I have another computer for XP anyway. Wow, this is bringing back memories. So let's go to next. Install. I do actually have a Windows Vista license key somewhere. Yeah, I know, it's on the actual computer. Okay guys, I'll be right back. Let me type this in. Awesome, 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 awesome. So I got Windows Service Pack 2 to give this thing a fighting chance of actually working. To make sure this works, we're going to make sure these partitions are deleted and cleaned. Sorry about that little fan. There's no drivers for this GPU so it's going to be loud for a while. Good. Thankfully I should be able to get the drivers from the video because that's actually who made this motherboard believe it or not okay guys we'll be back in a while okay guys we are back we're not going to do like any user or something um Dell yeah 630i I like the standard that'll work Hey, we got it working. Oh, I remember this page. A little 
sweepy lines. Oh yeah, the widgets panel. I get rid of that. <laughs> yes, Internet Explorer. Mm, my favorite. Not my favorite. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You can't do nothing. We could do Chrome in all caps. You could display Chrome. Uh, oh my lord. Okay, now I'm starting to figure out. Yes, display the non secure item. Oh my god. Look at the eighth bar now. See? Yes, display it. Okay, don't ever show that again, please. Okay, um, Firefox then. Firefox. There. Google Chrome ain't gonna work. We're gonna do Fire. This video is just gonna be me yelling at the computer. Come on, I could still download Chrome on XP. How come I can't do it on here? I'll try Opera if I have to. Yes. Download, download, download. Download. Yes. Okay, good. We got 32 bit. That's that's kind of my. I should have got a 64, but I needed 32 for this game to work. That's why. The whole reason I'm doing this. I need to do is do like a don't ever click this again. Ooh, it's pissing me off. I need to get drivers for this thing, but save. I want, I'd rather save it. Save as an application to downloads. Thank you. Open folder. Let's try Firefox. I feel like that might work. Run. Hey, I think we got it working. I think. Allow. Next. 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 I'm a next guy, just click next, 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 next. Yeah. Ooh, my favorite, control panel, fancy. Do I miss the control panel? I just had everything you needed right here. We can just raise it for now until we download a driver or something. Get it to go. Okay, everybody, we are back. Um, did scare me a little bit, almost afraid it wasn't gonna work. As you can see, this sounds a little glitchy. Yes, both cards are on here perfectly fine. No issues. Um, yeah, so this thing's set to go. All the drivers are on here. It's working great. Um, just do not turn on SLI. Number one rule. So thank you guys for watching.